Uh, okay. All right, best go. Hey there, bestie. We've got a new target. Cromdo's back in town. Yep. I know that greedy crumbag has some juicy dirt. I'm not talking about his pathetic little lies or scams either. I'm sure you'll find something good. Don't let me down, bestie. <laughs> I will do that later because I'm going to talk to Mr. Philbo here. You're doing a great job, buddy. But hey, don't forget to take care of yourself. In fact, maybe you should turn in early today and just relax. Good idea. Take a quick nap. Stuff is dead. Huh. Something's wrong, buddy. I was we trying to, but you stopped me. Africa, Ramble, what happened? We saw something real spooky walk right into town. I thought it was a grumpus at first, but like Where'd it something go? about it was wrong was this creature wearing a crown by any chance or was it perhaps holding some sort of ceremonial dagger what no no nothing like that it looked kind of normal until it oh, until it it turned into a bunch of bug snacks and like scattered what frankly i find that hard to swallow ah uh, what a load biff not enough drama around town for you lately huh zonk off cromdo Unlike you, I don't lie for a living. Oh, wow. So tell me then, what were you doing skulking around at midnight? Breaking in the huts? Again? I seen it too. And this time I know it's not just one of my nightmares. Get some someone else saw it. sleep, Gramble. I can't. Not with all of y'all around here with your hungry mouths. Don't take this the wrong way, darling, but you are a bit high strung. A little beauty sleep would do you wonders. Maybe then so you tall finally let us eat everyone a few else. Pets. You say that again. Don't get off me. Stop. Whoa, hey, chill the grump out, bros. There's no need for all that. If what Gramble and Befica are saying is true, there's got to be some physical evidence left behind. Yeah? Indeed. We should sweep the perimeter and keep watch in case the creature returns. Um, uh, good idea. Uh, buddy, do you think you can scope out the restroom? You know, find out what they saw? <laughs> we'll go to the shitter again. <laughs> Smells like snacks. Out there. Look, a strabby. Bug stacks scatter from where the Grumpus's tracks stop. in the shitter man no more bug stacks the warning you found what you were looking for all right I'll call everybody together yeah someone doesn't want well, us to bug snacks anymore what did you find That's, um, I reckon there's got to be some other explanation. Cram it, Wampo. We got a genuine monster on our paws. Hmm. Monster's a bit of a prejudicial term, don't you think? I'd call it more of a cryptid or undiscovered animal. It's no animal, darling. We're witnessing the queen of bug snacks in action. She's given us a warning! Yep, right there. No more bug oh, snacks. That is That's absurd. a warning. Which is more likely that a so far unseen giant bug snack politely left a note on our door 
or that this is some form of coordinated gaslighting by the Grumpenot... What's more likely, dear, is that you've watched far too many movies. But at least my theory has scientific data behind it, whereas you haven't even drawn one chart. <gasps> I was top of the charts, thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know what? Let's split the difference, eh? You're both wrong. Uh, what does it even matter? Whatever it is, it wants us dead. Between this and the earthquakes, Snacksburg's becoming pretty unlivable. I hate to say it, bro, but I regret coming down from the mountain. Me and Snorpy were a lot safer before we came back. Same goes for me and my little ones. No, no, no. We shouldn't split up again. We're better off if we're all here Our together. Our numbers, guys. That might have been true when Lisbert was around, but those days are long gone. Y you don't know that. She might come back. <laughs> don't hold your breath, pal. Face it, Bilbo. Without Lisbert, all we have is you. That's... that's... not true. Listen, Very I don't know why Lisbert put me in charge, but I do know this. None of you were really happy out there alone. We don't have Lisbert, but we have each other. Maybe if we try, we could all add up to one of her. <sighs> I guess you're not wrong. Our numbers. So we're all staying in town then? Seems like it, as long as we can watch each other's backs. If we're gonna make it, we need everybody here. Floofy and Shelda are still out there, and, and who knows if they're safe? If you Floofy must and find Floofy. According to the tracking device I placed on them, they're out by Boiling Bay. And the last time I saw Shelda, she was meditating in the sizzling sands. But don't forget about Egabel. If she's not with Lisbert, we gotta find her. We will, Chandlo. And once we do, we'll throw a big welcome back party. How does that sound? Okay. Great! Now, let's go get some sleep. Sure. Sure, it's the Frost Park. Hi, Chandlo. Alright, so... Some rain here. There. Evening. All right. So what I what I need to do? Since I'm here, I need to. If Snorpy needs to talk to me about something, okay, that's fine. I need to catch a greedy, greedy, aggressive, meaty bugs. Catch a buffalo locust. Find out Cramdo does at midnight. First of all, let's see if we can find Snorpy. Let's wiggle. This tall motherfucker should be shouldn't be that hard to find. Then there's I also need to sleep until midnight-ish, so I can catch Cromdo or Befica. There you are. Ah, chum. Good to see you on this ordinary tyranny-free day. Let us talk pleasantly of the weathers. It's raining. I really like it. I've discovered something terrible. My seismic readings show that activity in the mountain is growing stronger and more frequent over time. We must find the source of the quakes before the situation grows out of control. There is an unusually large bug snack on the mountain that I'm certain is involved. The formidable Scoopy Banoopy. Scoopy Banoopy? And dispose of the components in my mouth, and once more we will have thwarted the Grumpanati. <laughs> Scoopy Banoopy? Alright, I need to. I can just sleep in anyone's shit, so. <sighs> so... Alright, Cromdo. Where you going, Comdo? Having trouble with your pets there? Shut it, Wambus. My little ones are just excited hey, to see you, me. Hey, you go, That's so. Comdo. Bet it's easy to keep them in line when they're half your size. What are you saying? You really love bug snacks so bad? Go big or go home. Guys, I'm, I need to go you catch Comdo. If you could kind of shut back to your up. Cactus, you old coot. 
Yeah, I'll come back to you. Not awake, not asleep. Get up, everybody. Come on and do the wiggle with me. Do the wiggle. Do the wiggle. He just likes to, he likes to dance. I do the wiggle. Do the wiggle. Do the wiggle with me. Yeah! Man, is somebody there? You didn't hear anything, pal. You got that? Not a single peep! Don't worry. I don't see anything. Alright. What's up, bro? What? Where am I? Sleepwalking? Oh, thanks for waking me. You wanted to talk to me about something? I hate to say it, but... Lambus has a point. Bigger snacks means more to love. And they might be a bit smarter. Might respond uh, better to my training, I don't know too. How that works, but... Please get me the biggest, snackiest bug snacks you can find. Please. <laughs> donate praying picantis. And donate a Scooby Banoopy. Alright. So, whoa. Let me buffalo locust. I think lovely sweetie fly maybe i haven't seen it and it's just i had heard about it you know so as far as the side quests go we need Scooby Banoopy meaty bug snacks. So this one would be best for the uh, uh, flavor falls. I think it's back this way. Go through Garden Grove and then Flavor Falls into Garden Grove. I think it's what it was. Is it what it was? I can also catch a I can also catch a bunger here. Hey. He hates ketchup. Catch a bunger without. Did they catch one of these soda pop things? Yeah, Dr. Sodia did, yeah. Alright. I actually just need to catch one. I think I'm going the wrong way, to be honest. No, I didn't. Okay. Let me catch a sand of pee. Something above me. I just need to catch one of them. All right, I'm gonna. Oh, I'm gonna try this too. Oh, 
caught a whole thing of them. Wait, all right. This sticky glob is evidence of bug tax. It seems to only appear when it rains. Well, it's not raining right now, so. I think that should be it for Chandlow. Buffalo locust. I need some big shit. Then I need to talk to Befica. Okay. Sup, Strabby. Sup, Strabby. Then you go feed Chandlow. Talk to Befica. Ah, I'm just saying, uh, maybe. Your whole premise is flawed from the get-go. If bug snacks aren't like plants, then no amount of elbow grease is gonna make this work. Triffy, I thought you were here to support me. Oh, oh I am. It, it's just, um, you keep trying this over and over, and one of these days you gotta pack it in. <sighs> There's Chandler right there, oh, so you can feed him. Well, if that's how you choose to look at it, 